There's a new report from U.S. News and World Report naming Raleigh and Durham as two of the, how to, the hottest housing markets in the country. Yeah, CBS 17's Joseph Holloway is getting answers from a real estate agent on what that could mean for housing prices over the next few months. The U.S. News Housing Market Index lists Raleigh as the second hottest housing market in the country, and Durham is at number four. So we've got a large secondary bedroom. It's news um, that doesn't surprise the, MI Home the, sales the, consultant the, Jake nice. Jablonski, who is selling homes in Raleigh's new North Ridge Point subdivision. We've sold 14 houses in the last 45 days. He says the new year brought a new boost in people looking for a home. We've probably had an increase in, in walk-in and internet traffic. Traffic. Um, that's doubled where we were in, say, October, November. A lot of the houses in this subdivision are in the $600,000 to $700,000 range. And the agent tells me with how the market is looking right now, that price will probably keep going up. And as the year goes on, agents say it'll probably be that way across the triangle. We're going to see some of these promotional incentives starting to fade away um, as, this, as this traffic picks up we're going to see kind of less and less builders willing to give. Experts predict the Federal Reserve will cut interest rates at some point this year, which would likely increase demand and drive up prices. In Raleigh, Joseph Holloway, CBS 17 News.